conservative new media viewers and Jeremy Lin fans around the world. What's going on? We have some more information to pass to you about Jay Lin. Uh, in an interview with the Wall Street Journal, Yao Ming, the former NBA star who also played for the Houston Rockets, as Jeremy does now, mentioned Jeremy Lin while talking to the interviewer. Now, we'll put two links about this story in the video description below the video player so you can check out more for yourself. Yao is a co-owner of the Shanghai Sharks of the Chinese Basketball Association, also known as the CBA. Yao was talking about ways in which he can help basketball grow in his homeland of China, in ways in which he can kind of help local talent there develop, because in the CBA, they've been bringing in more foreign players recently, people like Tracy McGrady, Stefan Marbury, and Yao's cool with that, he likes that, but he also wants, you know, what are ways in which the local talent can also develop. Now, Yao mentioned that he thinks children there in China need a little bit more time to be able to play the game, maybe a little bit less time spent studying and some more time being able to play basketball and do other physical activities. He was saying maybe a little bit more balance in the children's timetable and their, their time structure. What he said is that Jeremy Lin shows that a person can be successful both on and off the court and in the classroom specifically. And he says that this will help set an example for all of the basketball fans and for the families in China. Of course, Jeremy Lin is a Harvard graduate in the Ivy League in the United States, so he certainly achieved the highest level pretty much of education or higher education. And obviously, he's in the NBA as well, so he's, he's at the highest level of basketball in this country. So it's a good example of somebody that was able to do both things. What Yao said about this is, quote, he proved that it's not necessary to give up education to become a great athlete, unquote. Now, Yao also said that he thinks because Jeremy is relatively average sized, uh, you know, a six foot three guy as compared to Yao, who's seven foot four, I believe, he says that will also help people to be able to relate to Jeremy and think that they can be like Jeremy. He said not everybody can be really, really tall as Yao is. But a lot of people are six foot two, six foot three, as Jeremy Lin is. So that's the wrap up. Uh, always good to hear from Yao Ming. I love Yao Ming. I, I know he's doing well in his post NBA career, which was his NBA career was cut short because of injuries. But uh, good to hear from him, and he's doing well. And uh, always good to uh, talk about Jeremy Lin. So we wanted to relay you guys to that. Comments below. Thumbs up, thumbs down on this video course we encourage you to come and join the conservative new media facebook group over 2,000 members there and growing you'll find a link for that group in the video description i am paul f villarreal the nba expert thanks a lot for watching conservative new media we strive to be the number one youtube jeremy lynn fan channel we will talk to you again soon